First, an intense manhunt continues in South Philly. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Jessica Cartalia. Right now, a number of law enforcement agencies are looking for 20-year-old Dewan Robinson. He's wanted in connection with two murders in Delaware. We're told around 11 this morning, officers attempted to pull him over in Wilmington. He took off and was involved in two crashes, one on I-95, the other at Broad and Oregon. That's where he then ditched his car and took off on foot. We have team coverage on this developing story. We begin with Joe Holden. He joins us live from South Philly with the very latest. Joe? Good evening. And the last time that this person was seen, he was heading east down Oregon Avenue. We are now six hours into this search as a Philadelphia police helicopter hovers overhead. Wreckage on Interstate 95. A person of interest in two homicides runs from police. Those officers from Wilmington and a Pennsylvania State Police trooper crash on the highway. The fleeing suspect, law enforcement identified as Dewan Robinson, outran officers making it to South Philadelphia. His slate gray Acura, police say, slammed into a white Honda. Both sedans then plowed into this SEPTA bus. Evan Ewan was on board. Our bus was stopped here picking up more people, and the black car with uh, the suspect, whoever, came coming around the corner, hit another white car with an elderly lady in it. They slammed into us, and before the car even stopped moving, he was out of the car booking it running. He went east down Oregon, according to eyewitnesses. Police have been working to catch Robinson all afternoon. The SWAT team was called out for reports of suspicious activity, glass breaking and possible gunshots, but no Dewan Robinson. Schools locked down, schedules modified, as police searched for a man they described armed and dangerous. Asked if Robinson was watching what police would want him to know. Just turn yourself in, surrender. Let's you know, add some peace to what is right now rather chaotic given the things that have led up to us being here. And it has been chaotic all afternoon. Now into the evening here in South Philadelphia. Police, of course, maintaining a very strong presence as this manhunt continues. Reporting live in South Philadelphia, Joe Holton, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Joe, thanks. I would assume